So are you living in a one bedroom apartment or you need to get a one bedroom apartment? Here are some tips to make your one bedroom apartment really work for you. Hi, I'm Anna Scheller with Capri Temporary Housing and we work with quite a few one bedroom apartments. Now these tips are for somebody who's doing this on their own. We do this for other people, but in your case, you're going to want to maximize that space while still having places for entertaining, relaxing and working if you're still working from home. One bedroom apartments can be a little cozy but you can make this space work for all your needs. So whether you're living solo or you're living with a partner, it's all about maximizing every corner and every space in your apartment so that you can enjoy the place that you live. Let's dive into some tips to help you get the most out of your one bedroom apartment. Let's start by talking about multifunctional furniture. Now, what do I mean by that? I'm talking about something that can do more than one purpose. Maybe in your parents' home or in someone else's home, the couch is just the couch. But did you know that there are sofas available that can also double as beds? Futons are a great example of what you can use that will maximize space and be multifunctional. Think about a coffee table. Now, a coffee table can just seem like a place to put stuff when you're watching TV, but it can also serve as a desk for you. Not only that, but there are coffee tables that you can use for storage. So go to a garage sale or go to a thrift store. Somebody no longer needed something that could serve as storage. When I was much younger and needing to be more thrifty and li living in smaller spaces, we often got tables that we could use for storage as well. Speaking of storage, get an ottoman. Now what's that? That's kind of like one of those stuffy things that you put your feet on when you're watching TV. But many times those can also serve as storage to put those really important things. Or maybe you're a puzzle person and you really enjoy puzzles. Great place to put your puzzles and games, things that you're going to use for entertaining when you have company come over. Additionally, Ottomans make a great extra chair when you have too many friends and not enough places for them to sit. Speaking of coffee tables, a lot of modern furniture doesn't tend to have storage underneath. There's no drawers or anything below the coffee table to use for storage. But if you're thrifting or garage sailing, a lot of older furniture will have drawers and places for you to store whatever you need to store, things that you want to keep out of sight. Now, if you don't find something like that, here's a little tip. You can always go to Walmart and get one of those cubes and use that for storage to put under your coffee table as well. If you don't already have drawers in your coffee table or you haven't been able to find one like that, these might be a little less conventional, but they'll still serve a purpose and they will look very attractive. Tip number two, look up. What do I mean by that? Well, in a one bedroom apartment, a lot of times floor space can be at a premium. So what can you do with some of those things that you need to keep, but you're starting to run out of space on the floor? Use the vertical space, get some bookshelves or get those command hooks. I love those and I use them around my house to hang up even things like cooking utensils. Here's another added benefit of using wall space with things like command hooks, shelves, bookshelves, or even hanging organizers. That is not only are you saving precious floor space, but it also becomes part of the decor that is you. And that's exciting when you think about it. Again, Walmart's one of your best friends here. Speaking of bookshelves, maybe you're not comfortable with having a bookshelf taking up some of your floor space. Did you know that hanging bookshelves have become quite trendy? You can look online or probably find in any of the reasonably priced stores like Marshall's or Ross, and you can find those to hang on your wall and not take up more of your precious floor space. They are functional, attractive, and they keep your aesthetic nice and tidy. Finally, create defined zones for different activities. You know, even in your small apartment, you need to have places where 
you just eat and where you work and where you can relax and fall asleep. So you can do this in a small apartment with simple things like a rug or a specific piece of furniture or even plants can define a space for you so that you are creating zones. So whether you're working or you're just relaxing, you can have a space designated for that, which enables you to be able to flow into that zone much more quickly. With a few smart choices and creative use of your space, your one bedroom apartment can be made to fit all of your living needs. Thank you for liking and commenting and sharing this video with your friends. If you find this helpful, go ahead and subscribe so that you can get more of these tips about how to make your space more homey for you. Thanks for watching.